Hi guys, good morning, or good afternoon actually, it's like 1 p.m. Uh, I've been busy with emails for my 501c that I help run and uh, starting to do housework. Uh, I think I'm gonna do another vlog for the next couple days because everybody says they like longer videos and I really want to do that. Right now the house is a mess, I'm trying to get it all done. It's already one o'clock and I started earlier, but everything's just out of place. I mean, we just screen cleaned the other day. It doesn't even look, look like we've done anything, but uh, yeah, I'm gonna do a vlog. Uh, yeah, and uh, sorry, just kind of closing the gate here. You can see a big mess, I had to clean the bed, I had to make the beds and stuff. But yeah, um, everybody wants to know the story of the dogs and how we named them. So I guess I will start with that. So uh, Charmy, which I will actually go over there. Give me a second. So Charmy is Here, this is Charmy, she's 13. And uh, her mother's name was Lucky. And so uh, I named her Charm, Charmy. So like Lucky Charms. And uh, she, uh, she's, oh my God, you see all the dirty clothes. I'm so sorry. Uh, she, uh, yeah, she's just been very charming and everything like that. And so, yeah, that's the name of Charmy and why we named her, why I named her Charmy. And, uh, I'm still getting hung, hang of this tripod and I just stick my hands. And then the boys are here. Leo is because we're Leos. And so, yeah, so he is named Leo and Rex, his brother here is because he, he always like bit our toes and everything and he was just kind of like a dinosaur, so Rex. So T-Rex, Rexford, this is Rex. And then Sid is from a video game. And then Colby, I, I just saw some cute C names and Colby was one of them. And so yeah, Colby is from that. So yeah, let's everybody drink some water because water is important. So cheers. Yes, got some water. So I'm gonna start cleaning, get everything done, and then I will get back to you guys a little later on when I have more to say. I, yeah, cause I need to update you guys on some things, but I will do that later today or once I get done cleaning. So let's get to it. All right. All right, guys, I don't know if you can hear me. I have my AirPod in. Uh, I'll watch this back and make sure if not, figure something out. This has been a weekend. I, I've been kind of down. Uh, I know it's probably just like routine stuff that I need to get done, but uh, on the 18th, I have a uh, another biopsy surgery type thing. And then they're also gonna be doing a colonoscopy. A colonoscopy, I can never say this word right. Colonoscopy, yeah. I'll put the word there, but yeah, I'm going to be doing that. It's my first one that I've, I mean, I've had biopsies done before, just not the colon, that word. Yes, the colonoscopy. Uh, words are just hard right now. Um, I kicked the thing again. Anyways, um, I, yeah, I just cancer runs in my family so it's just it's really hard and uh just sad and then i've been getting a lot of like people that are jealous of me sending a package to michelle telling me that it, i i i'm wrong for sending it to her because she's married and you know i've been ignoring all that bullshit because i don't need it 
it's just hard when you're just getting bad news after bad news after bad, bad news. Or it's not really bad news. They're catching it early. And they're just putting up with this. They're just saying all this bullshit. And are like disliking my videos and bringing my, my thing down just because they're... I'm a small channel and it's ridiculous. So, you know, I, I like, I've been ignoring the haters because the, the love outweighs the bad. It's just, it's just, it just sucks, you know, because I, I try to spend, I, I try to do a much, I spend a lot of positivity on other people. I just, I don't get it back. It doesn't seem like, I mean, I have not seen you guys because you guys have been good and, and loving and, and even the my moderators, which are Jessica and uh, Janet, Janet, Janet's been a moderator since I started my channel. Or excuse, yeah, Janet has been a moderator since I started the channel, and then I I just put Jessica as a moderator too, and I appreciate both of them because I know them. I've known them for a while from Michelle's channel, and they're sweet people. So I I appreciate both of you. Thank you guys for helping me and deleting all the horrible comments because it's kind of sad to do it by yourself and all this stuff but yeah all the bad is out of the way I, I talked about that so on that on that week or that day I'm not sure if there'll be a lot of content on my channel I so I I, I don't know if I'm gonna pre-film some stuff so I can have some stuff up for you guys or if I just go silent on the 18th I also have an open house thing that uh, it's our second anniversary at my 501c clutch, so I have to, I, I'm, I, I have to be doing that too. So and then also I be back from Las Vegas. So this week is that week is kind of like very busy for me. So yeah, I'll see what I could do. I probably will do maybe a week vlog and then. I know I'll be posting some shorts. I'll, I'll just like pre-film some shorts and then post it for when, when I have the surgery. So yeah. Anyways, um, I wanted to, I wanted to give you guys an update on our plants that we've, we got growing here. And then also I, um, I've been loving some new music, especially Casey Musgraves, this deeper well. I've been putting in a lot on, on my shorts because you're allowed to, you know, put other music on there. This one is good. This one is one actually smells like um, her boy smells fragrance, and then her her new fragrance that she put out. It actually smells really good. The inside does, and I'll show you the sleeve. It's just a beautiful record. I'll take it out of it. The plastic. I mean, I tried to keep my vinyls in good condition. She's just a beautiful artist. I love Casey. But yeah, here's the back. Here's the songs. I don't know if you can read that or zoom it or pause it. And then, but yeah, the inside is so gorgeous. And then, this is the the part that actually smells so earthy and beautiful. Yeah, I it's like I never had to I think this is one of the first like scented sleeves on a vinyl, but it's beautiful. This is what it looks like. It's just and then the vinyl itself is like a translucent color. It's so pretty. So yeah, and then yeah, there's just all the I think just all the people who wrote the and then the vocals and everything on the album. Such a beautiful, gorgeous album. She's so beautiful. So yeah, I have that that I've been I've been listening to it ever since that she uh, ever since she I think she this is sometime in March she uh, she uh, did this. So yeah, I'll put that back on there. And then uh, yeah, I'm gonna. Flip you around to show you the uh, the growth and the the starting plants that we have. So let's turn you around. So yeah, you can see all the growth that we have on the 
the plants. Everything is starting to pop up beautifully over here too. Mostly all flowers over here. Oh, we have some cucumbers that are coming up as well. Dragon egg cucumbers and then some zinnias that are coming up uh yeah the zinnia mix is all coming up we're still waiting on the other zinnias to pop up but uh i don't know what this is but we have a lot of the swiss chard is up uh caesar mix a lot of the salads are up kale so yeah and then I also showed you in the garden uh, other stuff that we have growing. So yeah, anyways, I'll talk to you guys in a little bit. Hi, I just want to tell you that you are amazing. And I hope you have a wonderful day. Thanks for watching this video. All right, just be kind to everybody because you don't know what they're going through. Have a wonderful day. All right, it's a little while later. Sorry for being down earlier. I just wanted to get that off my, my chest and I feel like uh, we're friends and so I feel like I can talk to you guys. I really don't. I mean, I have friends on the outside that I talk to, but you know, everybody has lives and yeah, I just, sometimes it's like, it's hard, you know? Life sucks. I close this or the cats will go in and ruin the plants. Uh, it's kind of a gloomy day out today, so I don't know. Is uh, Oh, it's just hair. I thought it was something on my face. Anyways, I am struggling to find, figure out what to do with anything. I, you're on this new tripod and, and uh, so yeah, I'm just figuring out some stuff. Under, no, it doesn't do that. All right, well, I was gonna show you Colby, but I'll have to flip you around, so just a second. Here's Colby, just being a cute little baby, posing for the camera. Leo had all the toys out. Playing. Get your ball. Get your ball, Leo. Where's your ball? And there's Charmy and Rex. being goofballs. And Leo with his ball. So yeah, the cats like to knock over the signs and stuff when they're on stuff. Rex, what are you doing, dude? Jeremy! All his life. <laughs> He's going to show you his toy.
All right, guys, it's much later. And that's kind of why I watched one of my friends, uh, Pam's YouTube videos. It was like an hour long, which it's my favorite too. I know people are saying they like longer videos. And you no, know, I like them too. I like uh, checking out what my friends are up to and their lives and seeing what they do, you know, what they do too. Yeah, my last clip or something down there when I was ranting about, you know, the stuff about my doctors. It was on Monday, this appointment, because I, I vlogged the one over the week, uh, my doctor's appointment on Friday. But this one was one during my physical. My doctor wanted me to get a checkup for, um, for this uh, pre-cancer that I have, so... And when I went, they they found some things and they said it was time to get a biopsies done and all that type of stuff. So, yeah, I'm okay. I just, you know, it's just, it's scary. And, you know, everybody should be checked because cancer is very scary and it's important to, you know, keep track of everything and make sure that you're healthy. So, yeah. Anyways, uh... I'm gonna be making dinner here soon, probably in the next couple hours. I'm not making anything relatively, um, because, or, yeah, I'm not making anything really big. I think I'm just gonna make some stuffing. I don't think I have any onions. I like, oh, I have, no, I do have a half onion in the fridge. Somewhere in there. And then, yeah, so I have some stuff I'm going to be doing. So I'm going to do some stuffing. And I don't know. I'm, I'm going to figure it out. I'm going to figure out some stuff. We also have some it's cornbread. Hmm. I was just looking at this cornbread. We do have this. But, you know, this bread, carbs on carbs on carbs. Give this one, too. Maybe I'll make some... I should have done it earlier. I had some black beans and stuff. Could have made a... A crop pot meal, but... I don't have any of that stuff out. And I don't want to sit there and... dirty up more dishes that I'm gonna have to do anyways. I don't know where our little stopper is for so I wasn't able to do the dishes that I already have in my sink. And catching up on laundry. Uh but yeah I really don't know to mess in here what I'm gonna do. I have all of our canned stuff over here. And all of that is, I don't know. I'll figure it out. Yes, I will figure it out. All right, well, I don't know. I'm just kind of rambling now because I really don't know what else to say. It is one of those days I'm still out of it and I don't know. I need to start actually packing for Vegas because we leave and today is Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, six days until we leave. And I think I'm gonna do a vlog in Vegas and I'll do some other, uh, like short clips and stuff and I'll post them because I want to get as much content as I can in Vegas while enjoying myself because one I want to document it for myself and I also want to document it for you guys so yeah I think I will do a Vegas vlog in which I probably won't we get back from Vegas we we leave on the first Tuesday of April when we get back that Thursday, so it's only Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. We're there Thursday, 
for like a few hours. We come home Thursday night. So yeah, I I want to get some bunch of content. Like, I don't know. Uh, I know a lot of people are saying that they haven't been to Vegas and I haven't been to Vegas since I was, I think, 19. Um, I think I did go when we just drove through it one time. Later, uh, I don't know where to hold this. Uh, yeah, so there's that. I've been sipping on this cherry Coke for hours. I've been, I, I drink a lot more water these days, but I kind of wanted something bubbly. I should have got a seltzer, but. There's that. Uh, anyways, uh, again, how many times can I say ah? Uh, I will kind of talk to you guys later. Oh wait, no, I kind of want to show you something. I'm gonna show you our magnets. So give me a second. So here's most of the magnets that I've got, we've gotten from our trips or one I've gotten from Alaska, just like certain ones. There are the dogs. I, I, there's a, a, you might recognize this picture I did about the dogs, but yeah. There's Le uh, Rex, Charmy, Leo. So yeah. And then just some Montana, Alaska, the Iditarod. This is a Dolly Parton one I got. We got from a music store. We got this when we were in uh, Yellowstone, and then this is from Bath and Body Works. This is actually a candle topper. These I made. They actually glow in the dark. Kind of recognize the the stars for me, but yeah, I just kind of was testing out some glow in the dark paint. This is handmade. I got it. Oh, this is my my old cat bandit. She she died a while ago, but she was my childhood cat. Hers there as a kitten. But yeah, I got this. My my aunt Booty. She she gave me this. She bought it for me. Oh, and then our cat. Um, this is Kit. She actually ran away um, almost a year ago. So we we. We miss Kit, uh, and then there's Sidman. But yeah, that was our original cats. Colby, we don't have actually a picture of on the fridge, but we should. And then I got this in Seattle. I had a layover in Seattle when I went to Alaska. So yeah, uh, I gotta go guys. I'll talk to you guys later. Sorry about that guys. I had a uh, phone call. Oh, sorry, shouldn't. That's better. I was trying to adjust this. I had to put you guys back onto the thing. Another doctor's appointment being scheduled. This one is because I've been having like hearing problems. Not really hearing problems. I just have a clogged ear. So just scheduling a doctor's appointment for that. Anyways, yeah. I was showing you my magnets before uh, I got cut off. I think I pretty much showed them all. I have a few other ones. I mean, I got w one of these from being brought back from because they went on, a, my partner went on a trip to Wyoming, but yeah. And then uh, Oregon, because we only live like an hour away from Oregon, the Oregon border. And we got this in Ontario, Oregon. But yeah, we live pretty close. And then, uh, I got this one too, which is like the little state quarter for Alaska. Thought it was pretty cool, so I brought it home. And then my little sister, she went to Alaska before me and brought this home. It's just a little moving little magnet. I thought it was pretty. Yeah, my little sister brought this for me, so yeah. So yeah, I, that's pretty much all the magnets that we have. Well, I mean, I have a few others, but they have appointments and stuff on them and my address, so I will not be showing those. <laughs> Anyways, 
I think it's raining out there. I need to go get uh, my uh, trash can. So I guess we can do that. I don't care if the neighbors, the neighbors are weird anyways, so let's go do that. Let's go get the trash can. Drive too fast down our road. It's only 25 through our neighborhood. And it's like a cut through street. A lot of people go through it. And it's only 25 and people go way above that. It's sad because it's like, what if, what if there's an animal or a kid playing and Oh, it's horrible. They they just go fast. I don't care. Like I said, my town used to be like the population has went from like we used to be a small farming town. We only had like uh, when I was growing up, we had like under thirty thousand people here, and then just started rapidly growing. And then after the recently in the last like since the pandemic. Idaho, like Idaho is becoming one of the fastest growing states in the nation. Everybody is moving here. So yeah, like we went from being a small town like farm to over 100,000 people in my little town. It's not little anymore. And uh, yeah, Boise is even worse. I don't even recognize it anymore. It's kind of hard to, like I'll remember the streets, but like there's like the landmarks have changed and we don't live there for so long. You just forget what everything's going on, but yeah. It's all changed. And there's this like, like this big, huge uh, sporting goods store. It's called like Shields. Has like a uh, Ferris wheel in it. And uh, it's like three stories. It has like a huge bunch of candy store. It's like bigger than a, uh, uh, I don't know why I'm walking around, but it's bigger than uh, Cabela's. Oh yeah, and they have a saltwater tank. They have a bunch of stuff, but uh, it's going into the next town over for me. It's not actually that far away. It's opening in April. It actually opens when we leave. Um, I think we'll be gone Why? why it opens. And then, uh, there's just a bunch of stuff going in that I just don't recognize. And this is, this is crazy because I am not used to all this traffic and people. Like when I go to the store to try to film, it's just crowded with people. And it never used to be like that. So it's kind of weird walking into a store and start filming. But I'm trying to go off of what uh, Michelle said in one of her recent videos. She goes, you know, just just do it and just ignore what the people say. Because, I mean, if they're just going to stare, just smile and keep doing what you're doing. I think that's what she says. She said something very close. Just keep doing it, you know. Uh, it just, you know, it gets, it gets, ner I just get nervous. Even when I went out there to go to the trash, I, it was so nervous to bring you guys out here. Because I just didn't want someone to look at me and think I was weird. But whatever. I like, I like uh, documenting my life for you guys and uh, I like just hanging out because, yeah, you guys are my friends and I appreciate you all. And, you know, I, I also wanted to thank, I, I, I've i recently gained a whole bunch of subscribers and I want to thank you all for that because it means a lot to me. <laughs> when I first started this channel, I had like, I think it was like 20 subscribers, so... It's really gained, I, I think I actually started to like doing videos, my first like serious video. I did one with uh, when Michelle sent me a package in August. I did a video for that. And that one did pretty well. And then I did, uh, what else? Uh, 
I did my candle day haul, which was from Bath and Body Works. They do like a candle sale um, every every December, the first Saturday in December. It's usually now, it used to be the first Saturday, but now they do it Friday, Saturday, Sunday, like three days. Like app reward members get it first, but the, ch the candles are very cheap. They're only $9.95, like $9.95. So I usually go, I used to go crazy because it used to be cheaper than that. And I used to get so many candles. Uh, but I've since uh, downgraded everything. I don't collect like I used to anymore. I mean, I still burn candles because you can see there's a candle over here. I still do that, but it's like not a priority to me anymore, you know? I like I said I sold all the other candles that I had and yeah I yeah I only I only get the candles to burn because I'm heartburn for some reason anyways uh I've been talking for a bit I trying to figure out what I can say Oh, I, I wanted to show you something, I guess. Some people are interested in my art. I have this I painted. It was with um, one of those paint markers, the Posca markers. So yeah, it's very cool. I mean, for a paint marker, I think it actually, I mean, I was just trying to test out the paint markers and I think it did pretty good. There's that. All the crystals we have, just like, some like, I think this is like a smoky quartz. Just some pretty, pretty crystals. Just one, two. And uh, we have some lava rocks. This is actually from somewhere special. And I don't know what this is. I think it's a, another lava rock. It looks like lava rock. There's a, this is actually a thunder egg. We actually uh, went because like I said, we do a lot of crystal hunting. And so we actually found this and uh, Logan actually cut it open. This is pretty cool. It's actually got a crystal inside of it, which is cool. Thunder eggs are pretty cool. And I don't know what, this is like pulls gold, um, whatever, uh, I forget what they call it, but it's pretty, very cool shiny and then this I don't know what it is but it's pretty cool yeah um that's all I oh yeah I'm not the really rock collector but this is pretty cool too anyways Yeah, oh, and this is a picture of the Northern Lights. I, my aunt bought this for me. I just thought it was a pretty picture. It's stunning, actually. We haven't got a frame for it, but it's pretty. I love it. Uh, yeah. It, there's, let me turn you around and I'll show you our fish. It, yeah, so there's our fish. We have a lot of terras and stuff. I don't know what the orange one is. But yeah. We just have a different tank. We have neon tetras in there too. They're down there. In the rock. We can see over here. Yeah, they're just hiding. There used to be more plants and stuff in there. 
We still have a lot more fish, but anyways, that is our fish tank. Plants we have. Yeah, I'll show you some of the plants we have. See, I think this is rosemary. Yeah, rosemary. And I don't know what half of these plants are. I know this is a um, African violet, and then that's an orchid. Um, don't know what this is. This is a money tree that we yeah we uh, trimmed down. Some succulents. That ground cover that I hauled in the video. Um, yeah. This plant. Yeah. Oh, poor chicken. Cats knock over the chicken. They knock it over all the time. I think they took the eyes off of it too. Because there used to be eyes on it too. But I think the cats. This guy right here took the eyes off it. And there's my Buddha down here. And all the dog toys, including the ones on the floor. And my slippers. Yeah. So I'm going to turn. Yeah, so there's kind of a tour of the, some of the plants we have. One of these days I'll kind of show you around here all the plants and whatever, but. One of my little target birds. I collect target birds too, and this little guy I got in Alaska. This, we got a uh, rock show. It's pretty. This is from Alaska as well. This is, got it at an indigenous store in Alaska. So, I usually have it up, but we are painting around here, so it's there for now. Um, yeah, I like, uh, I connect with the in indigenous cultures, as I said in previous videos. But yeah, um, all these pictures, this one in the middle, we actually got at Fred Meyer. These ones over here, we actually, we actually took. This is actually, I've actually shown a few few videos in the shorts. This is uh, Deadwood. I believe these are both Deadwood. Uh, the Deadwood River. This is the waterfall at Deadwood. And I have a video on that. I will link it down below. Along with the Deadwood River, I will link it down below if I remember. If not, mention it to me and I'll, I'll link it. And then uh, just a snowy clip. I'm not sure. I don't remember where we took this picture, but yeah, we have that. Uh, yeah, the people wanted to see. I had comments about uh, certain things. Here is Cupcake right here. She passed away. Along with my mother, she's in there as well. My cupcake was my mother's dog, so yeah, we have kind of memorial. I've showed in previous videos of her. I need to find a better spot for them, but they're, I don't know, right there. The, the cupcake is there, my mom and my grandfather. Yeah. Do you guys re see something here? That's was in my package. I I had to cut it off. I had to cut him off. Uh, let me see if I can get a better picture of him. Do you see it? <laughs> I had to put him on my wall. I don't know if anybody's caught him in other videos, but I've actually shown him a few times. But yeah, he's cute. He sits there now. And these are from a record store because uh, I collect vinyls. This is actually a, an event that happens every year, record store day. And this is some local artwork that they did. 
And uh, yeah, see, Record Store Day, Record Exchange, Downtown Boise. This is 2019. They're both from 2019. But yeah, and I have a few other ones, but I haven't put them up. Here is a, a better picture of Cupcake. But there's Leo and a little bit of Rex. Some more dragons. We call it dragons. And here's my mama in heaven. And I've shown these on a live. I've also shown them on my thing. I, I still haven't put things back together where, where they were. And then Charmy. And then, yeah, this is a... A map of Anchorage. And then I got this at the Chocolate Factory. And this actually was uh, indigenous made as well. Because they sell a lot of like indigenous stuff at the Chocolate Factory. I always say used to. I don't know if they still do. I haven't been there in over a year. This is Pioneer Woman. I bought it at Walmart. And then, yeah, some of my shot glasses, like... Here's a Seattle one that I got at the airport. Uh, a Glacier one. I think we got this one in, at Walmart. Somewhere we, we got this at. Some of them we got in a storage unit. We got this one at Yellowstone. We might have got these at the same time. Because they were selling them. I don't remember. Uh, when I went to... On a trip with my sister, I picked this up in Wendover. Uh, an Alaskan shot glass that actually got ruined because it was washed. Then the thing, if you can see, it's... And my friend that lives in Alaska is not my friend anymore. One of my friends in Alaska stopped talking to me and she actually picked him up for me, but we're not friends anymore. So I only have one that's busted. I have another Alaska shot glass somewhere. This one, Bear World, is in Idaho too. But we got this in a storage unit, I believe. And this one, this one is fading also in a storage unit. But yeah. Just kind of a little showing you a little bit of uh, the stuff that I haven't mentioned previously because people were asking because I've seen it in backgrounds of videos and stuff so I thought I would include it in this vlog because I there is I haven't gone anywhere and I don't think we're going to be going anywhere so yeah I I'm just going to show it here uh yeah. Anyways, I don't know what else to say. I kind of rambled a lot and I really don't know. I don't know what to say. <laughs> um, something will come to me. I, right now it's, uh, I think I'm just going to finish my my Reese's egg, my last Reese's egg. And I'm just gonna relax and gotta see what time it is. I can't check because I'm filming on my phone and see if I need to make dinner yet. Which, like I said, this is gonna be a lazy dinner. I really, I, um, I've been getting comments about if I'm gonna make another recipe in which I will. Sorry, moved you around. I will make another recipe soon. I just need to like prepare more because I felt like that video was all over the place. So yeah, I, I will definitely film something soon in a recipe. Since I have this longer um, tripod and stuff, it will be a lot much easier. I just want to get um, more ingredients and stuff. If you have some suggestions of stuff you would like to see, please leave it in the comments down below and I will consider making it. Anyways, uh, yeah, I'm going to eat this and I'm going to just kind of relax and unwind. So I'll talk to you guys in a little bit.
All right, guys, I'm gonna start cooking. I'm gonna just get some stuffing and a few other sides, so just gonna go to side note, because I don't want to really cook. I'm gonna use a, usually use a white, the yellow onion or whatever, but you don't have one? I did, but we must have used it over here, so I'm gonna use the rest of this one. Not a big deal. Using the this brand right here, we got these at Costco. Let's see if we can
Celery in the back. Jenny, where are you going? Ground sage here, we wash my hands with a little bit. I'm going to do a few little dashes of ground sage. I'm going to dissolve my happy and pleasant reason. I'm going to lift you up a little bit. I think you can kind of see it now. Another video, and we'll do a uh, better cooking video with an actual recipe I can do. But I'm just going down in my today, and I just want something kind of comforting. And so, yeah, stuffing it is.
these minutes are starting to look more translucent. Maybe they're about another minute when I look at this. Stuffing mix in it, which I already opened. Which I'm sure all of you guys know how to make stuffing, but I'm just trying to include something in this vlog because I've been doing this vlogging. But yeah, you understand. <laughs> and you all said you wanted to do cookie bees. And I will do more cookies in the future, but. Like I said, if you have any suggestions on stuff I should make, please leave down suggestions in the comments below, and I, I will take it into consideration. Probably will take your, your requests. I want to use recipes. Use. I put this in chicken last night, the seasoning the shell gave me. It is very delicious. I've used it a few times. This tea use all purpose seasoning. It's quite, no, it's really good. I really like it. Alright, well, I'm gonna put in a. Onions are pretty much well translucent for, for purple onions, so red onions are best translucent at this point. So we're gonna add these other sorts. Uh, no, I'm gonna add the water. And with that comes to a boil. I guess what, is, like, what does it say? The, something to watch is a pot. I forget the saying. Something about a pot never boils. Watch pot never boils. I guess that's why we shouldn't we shouldn't be watching this. <laughs> and it's starting to. Yeah, that was pretty hot. These ninja we have a uh, ninja pans we got from Costco, and they're, they like them. They they taste like eat. They're great. They're great pans. They love them actually. They're, they're quite cool. We've only had them for a couple months. And actually, more than a couple months. I think about them before Christmas. Once we bought them, and they're quite good. I actually like them a lot. I recommend the ninja pans. Pretty much what we have a ninja. Yeah. I like this is a ninja bullet. Yeah, this is a ninja. It's a ninja bullet. You have one of those ninja bullet blenders? I don't know. We really don't have a lot of ninja products. Alright, it's starting to bubble up now. Now, what it comes to a full boil. I want to start stove. It's great. Since we got a new stove, this stove is really fast. It, uh. Yeah, it's really fast. I love this stove. And there we go. We have a boil. I'm going to put this down to. Full heat. Actually, I don't even think I'm going to start on the heat now. Oh, simmer. I'm going to start simmer. I'm going to simmer for three minutes. back when I get it to go to a simmer. All right guys, we've been simmering for three minutes now. So I'm gonna turn it off the heat. Add in my stuffing mix. All that seasoning in there, but I feel like this is stuck to the bag. This. the heat and then that will continue doing its thing oh I should have looked at that don't you hate that you you think you're done with the package and then you go to it after you throw it away that's me all the time oh like, okay I don't need this anymore and okay so this is gonna be standing for five minutes that's all I need to know on that uh, 
guess we'll do some green beans. I mean, how he likes spinach, so I guess we'll do some spinach for it. So I'm just gonna put some the green some green beans on the stove, and then I'm gonna put these ones in the microwave. I don't like putting the, the things in there, the whatever. We just drain it. And I like to season these as well. So I'll do it with just a little bit of garlic powder, or onion powder, excuse me, and I'll use the Costco garlic. Let's add a touch. I like to smooth in more. I mean, a little bit of butter. These are the, like I said, they can handle metal because they're the ninja. Ninja pans. So they can they can handle all the turn it off. But yeah, I'm just gonna continue getting on this all ready to go and cook. So uh really not that much stuff to do. I mean, like I said, it's just a lazy dinner. So yeah, I'm gonna let you guys go for now and I will talk to you guys in just a bit, okay? All right, guys. All right, guys, uh, it's gonna be the end of the vlog tonight. It's getting late. Um, I'm gonna try this Reese's cookie with you guys really quick and then I'll say, go say goodbye. It's very soft. You get a lot of peanut butter taste. Very buttery. It doesn't taste like a normal like peanut butter cookie. Mm. Good. Water. Cheers. Anyways, 
thank you all for watching my video today. Um, I hope you like it. There's a little bit of cooking, a little bit of ranting, a little bit of talking. Anyways, and I, I'm going to do a lot more fun things in the vlogs, but today's just kind of a chill vibe. So, yeah, I hope you enjoy. If you enjoy, please subscribe to my channel and leave me a comment and um, like this video. And I'll see you guys later. I hope you guys have a wonderful day, evening, morning, whenever you watch this. All right. Bye, guys.